everyone, I've got a few things to share with you today. Firstly, I've been asked how this doll compares size-wise to a Barbie. She is the MM Girl 12 Constellations Pisces. I really like her, she's lovely. She's uh, one of the dolls that I have on display in box on the shelf. But yeah, I've been getting a few questions about her on the box unboxing video I did of her. This is for you pushing lover three. You can see height wise, there's not a lot in it. She, she is a very similar size height wise to Barbie. I think she's a little bit bigger in the body, but not, not massively bigger. Her head is bigger. She's got more the um, head size of the Chinese Barbie dolls, hasn't she? She's so pretty though, really pretty doll. I love her hair colour, really love that. So yeah, she's she's a very similar size to a Barbie, I'd say. Um, maybe a tiny bit, tiny bit bigger, and she is a bit bigger in the head. Other than that, yeah, she's a fairly similar size. I was going to see if the Barbie dress would fit on her. Here we go that actually fits her very well indeed so you can yeah so there you go you can see that original barbie clothes will fit her i do think she's a bit smaller in the waist but there you go hope that was helpful to you pushing lover three next i have a parcel from ebay i believe i know what's in it so let's open it up and see if i am correct Nicely wrapped inside the bag in some bubble wrap. So the first doll in this bundle, and the reason I bought the bundle, is Rock Angel Sasha. Look at her, she's lovely. She's got her original boots, trousers, belt, and one earring. I do think I have got another one of those earrings, so I can soon replace that. So for her and the other doll in this parcel, I paid $14.99, and that included postage. So I think she was worth that on her own easily. Really pleased to have her. Really happy with her. And then the second doll is one that I've already got and have had loads of. Actually, she's quite a uh, she's quite a, a commonly found doll. Let's say. Mm. Yeah, and she is Crystalicious Chloe. She looks like she's had a haircut. Yeah, she she does look like she's had a haircut. Yeah, she you can see she's had had a bit of a haircut the last has, but I think yeah, I mean I got them for a good price. So I'm not gonna I'm not going to complain, but um, yeah, it wasn't mentioned that she'd got a haircut. Let's just say that. But yeah, she is a fairly commonly found doll. She is really pretty. I do like her. But I can just straighten her hair off across there and, and she'll be okay. Yeah, she'll be all right. But she is in her original dress and shoes, which is good. So that was those two. And then the next thing I'm going to do is open up my latest BTS boy. So this is Jimin. Let's see him. Let's get him out and have a look at him. I got him from... Toys R Us for $14.99 so I thought I'd get him out of the box and we'll have a look at him. Here he is, so he has the same articulation as the other BTS dolls that I've opened. That is head, I'm turning from side to side a little bit but not much in any other direction. He has shoulder, elbow and wrist articulation no waist or chest articulation he has had articulation at the hip the knee and also his foot he's wearing this very snazzy outfit uh, his silky jacket and trousers and i'm assuming that he'll be the same as the other dolls in that his 
shirt is attached. Very odd how they do that. His shirt is actually attached to his jacket, so you have to vel un velcro the shirt down the front. I'm assuming his tie velcros at the back. That's odd, his tie sort of, you have to loosen it, you have to loosen it like this to get it over his head. Very odd. I mean, what are they, what are they thinking, for goodness sake? These are, are they not designed for children to play with? I don't know. So anyway, you take off his shirt, you have to un loosen his tie and uh, tighten it back up again when you put it back on him. That's the only way you can undo that. Very odd. I mean I don't want to be having to loosen his tie when I want to take it off. I think what I'll do is I'll cut it at the back and add a tiny bit of velcro so it can come off like that. Also I will be detaching his shirt and making it separate because I, I mean I can't see the point in that at all. Anyway, let's have a look at his muscles. He's a very muscly boy. <laughs> you can see he's got a nice muscularly built body, but you can't swap his head because his neck is too small compared to the uh, uh, average Kendall. His hair is black with like a hazelnut brown streak in it and it is as hard as a hard thing. It's really stiff on his head. Um, I do like the faces on these dolls. I really like them. His trousers Velcro in the back there and he has on these quite large high top boots, I think. High top trainers. So that's our Jimmy. He will be getting his shirt altered and his tie altered because I can't be I can't be jiggering about like that every time I want to put him in something different, can I? Crack, it's like the blooming Krypton factor, isn't it? There's our Jim and he'll be joining the other three BTS boys that I've got. That was my little video for today. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now. Say bye, Jimin. Bye. Bye, folks.